sustainable wine growing is, is a series of best practices that growers and wineries and everyone who is involved throughout the entire process choose to, to implement. We're all interested in protecting the environment and conserving resources. It's important for us in California to be a part of the environment and part of the ecosystem. So by allowing the natural flora and fauna to remain, to planting on the contours of forests and creeks, and to maintaining that natural wildlife balance, we feel like we have a harmony and a holistic sort of um, approach to being a neighbor. California vineyards are designed and maintained to work with nature. Um, for example, habitat corridors between the upland and the, the uh, riparian cover where there's always um, water and nutrients for the animals that live in the upland areas. There's a number of strategies that we use to control pests here in the vineyard and one of them is by providing uh, homes for owls by out using owl boxes. The predators are able to uh, forage for the, the rodents that may be at issue uh, in the vineyard. There are a number of vineyards throughout the state who are using sheep or goats. Some of these vineyards allow this livestock to go into the vineyard and eat down the weeds. Cover crops are used in our vineyards for a variety of reasons. Cover crops will reduce um, erosion, increase water holding capacity, increase microbial activity, and increase organic matter. We do composting to really help build up our soil health, which is important to getting good quality fruit. Everybody, whether you're in the vineyard or in the winery, we're really focused on saving water, saving energy. These are all things that are great for the environment. They're great for the health of our industry. But then we also pay a lot of attention to the health and safety of our employees and how we interact with our neighbors because we're very much a part of our communities. We've been farming in a responsible manner for, for decades, literally decades. Uh, this program started back in 2002, 2002, and it has grown dramatically. We've had significant buy-in, and in fact, in a few short years, we've been able to have a majority of our growers, as well as our vintners, uh, adopt our code of sustainable wine growing practices. And when you think about how much time we spend in the vineyard thinking about every practice that we're doing or in the winery, how we're making that wine, you can't help but pay more attention to what the quality is like and really making sure that we get the best flavors that we possibly can. We're the stewards of the land. We have an obligation to do these types of programs and implement these types of practices. This is for us, for our consumers, and it's also for our families and for future generations. Mm -hmm.